Hi, what's up? So was that just a really cool intro or did I fail in that attempt? And, and it, it would kind of suck if I failed <laughs> attempting to make an intro, which is going to make this introduction kind of strange. But hi, how are you guys doing? So I'm at Scarborough in Cape Town and I thought that it might be a good idea uh, well, in fact, I'm not in Scarborough. I was on my way to Scarborough and then Misty Cliff rocks just grabbed my attention. And it's called Misty Cliffs because it is quite misty this evening. So I'm going to try and find a location and then I'll see you in like... I'll see you now. That's, that's what happened. <laughs> uh... So I'm going to try and do something really simple and I really do enjoy simple shots, but I do want to try and capture uh, the, I, th I think the beauty of, of this area and the clouds and everything that you can just imagine this area would look like. So that's what I'm aiming for. Uh, what I am going to do is the sun is pretty high up still so I, I have a, uh, a couple of hours still to go so I'm th I think I might do a simple simple exposure now and then see how that goes I'm gonna just fine-tune this because I uh, I don't think that I am happy with the composition so normally what I would do is find a composition when the Sun's not down quite yet and then try and try and just take a couple of test shots and see how that would go and I'm not happy with the test shots yet but uh, if you if you are interested uh, this is what it looks like on my screen I don't know if you guys can see that so let me just anyway so there's a guys if you if your camera can do this just get the Instagram on there uh, but let me take that off for a second there's a little rock there's a little rock there's a little rock and then the Sun's going down there so I want to sort of curve it I want this area to point into where the Sun's going down and then I yeah so I want to try and curve it but I'm just gonna refine it a little bit and okay so I I kind of messed up <laughs> that shot and it, it's a simple rule and I took the gamble but when you're doing seascapes and especially on the beach where the sand is all clear try and not step on the sand that you're about to shoot it just looks messy and if there isn't a big wave coming in and like now the tide is slowly moving back then basically you're screwed so you can't do anything about it oh that actually it looks like it's coming in so there's a lot of footprints in my shot and it's not anyone else's footprints it is my footprints no it's not going up high enough so now I'm in a rush, which I hate to do because I like to just take my time a bit. And uh, this, this is sad. Okay, so I found a, a different composition. It's not spectacular, but I think it might be a bit unique. <laughs> I'm going to see that rock there. I'm going to try and get the sun, which is there. To go there and then that line lead into where the sun is setting sort of create a summer misty I don't know what I'm gonna try and create create okay so I I don't often give up <laughs> I, I, I don't I, I really want to get a shot and I want to take it home and see what it looks like and especially with clouds and you won't be able to see this but it is <laughs> freaking beautiful out it is amazing there are colors that I obviously I'm not able even to pronounce uh, so I'm heading back to my first composition and then trying to see if I can do something there but I I guess I won't be able to just kind of sucks where I was at now there was someone in the shot the whole time so I have to crop the image 
we'll do something with Photoshop in my first, <coughs> I'm there now, my first composition doesn't exist anymore because the water is now it's just way too far away. So I'm going to take a picture anyway and then hopefully it turns out all right. This, the sky is lighting up. Look at that. <sighs> I'm gonna just shoot something. I, I saw a. Uh, uh, oh, the sun just disappeared. It's disappearing now. Anyway, so I saw a uh, image that might look good good at a 16 by 9. So I might crop it a lot. And uh, let me set up because the sun is, is, is disappearing. So I apologize for that, but I'll, I'll speak to you. Yeah, I'll speak to you. Oh, shucks. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm, there's two rocks, and then I'm going to use the sun as a third rock because threes are always cool. I don't know why they just look really cool so I'm gonna step it so that the two rocks sort of leads into the Sun shucks I don't have a lot of time I love it when I have to rush this much and my one leg is not working properly or well, I didn't pull it out I didn't make it it's not gonna make it Whew. That was, that, that was someone else that swore just now. That wasn't me because I don't swear on this channel. Yeah, okay. So what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to focus on the first rock. Do it at a F8. See what that looks like. Focus on that area. It's in focus now, sort of. There it's in focus. And then check my histogram. It looks all right take the shot focus on the second rock and then focus focus there same exposure so don't don't do something funny and then that already looks good I'm going to expose on f8 for the sky also this is what I'm doing pretty simple rock there rock there and then nothing so it's a pretty straightforward cut what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna crop a lot of the top off and a lot of it not a lot but some of the top and the bottom off and see how that goes you can see my Instagram is in the middle I am gonna shoot at f8 and then I'm just waiting I'm waiting for the shutter speed just to be perfect so that I can get some movement in the in the in the water I haven't said this but before I flight that image do me a solid subscribe to the channel uh, li like this if you did like the image if I fly if I did two images if I correctly exposed two images I mean that that is absolutely brilliant of me yeah. Uh, then you should definitely subscribe and then share it with your friends also I, I'm, I just need to run back uh, share it with your friends also but but if I just create one image I'm um, subscribe if you liked it like and do whatever but here's the image it's gonna be a longish one but I hope you enjoy it slightly more, more oh goodness look at that side light on this face isn't that pretty look at that sky 
So we've often, often pays to, to relax quite a bit and not get so angry and just wait it out. So I, I showed you that one image and then I did this thing and now I'm going to show you the next image which is in the same spot, probably just a little bit of a dip. Oh! Isn't that gorgeous? Uh, so similar, similar angle, longer exposure, sky has now turned into, I don't know what you call this, it's flippin' moy. If you translate that to English, it is, I guess flippin' is the same word, and moy is just, it's, it's flippin' beautiful. But flippin', it's a strange word. Look at this light on my face. Anyway, I'll flight this image. Thank you for watching. Until next time.